Greenland's ancient warm period reveals future climate risks. Studying Earth's past environments is critical for predicting the impacts of human-driven climate change. By looking at how the Arctic responded to warm periods millions of years ago, scientists can make more accurate predictions about what lies ahead. A groundbreaking study led by doctors Gina Mosley, Gabriella Koltai and Jonathan Baker at the University of Innsbruck, Austria has revealed Greenland's dramatically different past. Deep within ancient caves, the researchers discovered mineral deposits that provide evidence for a much warmer North Greenland during the late Miocene, a period stretching from around 11.6 to 5.3 million years ago. These deposits, known as speleothems, can only form in the presence of liquid water, suggesting that the region was warm enough for rainfall and flowing water during several periods in the late Miocene, conditions that seem unthinkable in today's frozen landscape. By analysing the oxygen and carbon isotopes, along with sodium concentrations in these formations, the team reconstructed past climate patterns, revealing fluctuations in temperature, precipitation and sea ice extent. One of the most striking findings of the research is evidence of intermittent warm and wet periods that once supported soil, vegetation and permafrost-free conditions in North Greenland millions of years ago. At the time, the region's average temperature was at least 14 degrees Celsius higher than today, coinciding with elevated North Atlantic sea surface temperatures and atmospheric carbon dioxide levels above 310 parts per million. To put that into perspective, we surpassed this threshold more than six decades ago. But the record also reveals interruptions, periods where no speleothems formed. These corresponded to times when carbon dioxide levels dipped below 310 parts per million and the North Atlantic cooled. Following one such hiatus, the team found an influx of metal elements in the cave, potentially the earliest evidence of a glacier or small ice cap forming in the region prior to 6.3 million years ago. The study highlights the relationship between atmospheric carbon dioxide levels and climate conditions, indicating that even small shifts in greenhouse gases can have profound effects on polar regions. Since Greenland's ice sheet today holds enough frozen water to raise global sea levels by several metres, these findings highlight its potential vulnerability. By investigating Greenland's climate history, the team's research provides crucial context for today's warming trends, helping scientists to refine their models to predict the future of our planet. Thank you.